to me, the mentor-mentee relationship is uh, almost a blood relationship. It's family, and it's, uh, but it's better than family. Of course I'll teach you how to give it. And Liz took this, um, uh, you know, embryonic idea and has fashioned it into this sweeping American epic. I see my job as, as keeping the play in my head and I protect the play that's in my head. Everybody gets tripped up. They do things to each other that they would not have done. You invite him up, it will be the ruin of you. They hadn't been determined to discover something that would make them big. I announce to you that I have made a remarkable discovery. I've heard it in readings, but to see people up on their feet actually without scripts saying it has been a thrill. Who was this man that discovered anesthesia? And then Robert Louis Stevenson read about what happened to Horace Wells and turned it and fashioned it into the strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. This man of immense goodness and humanity who, on the path of trying to make a better world, um, brings havoc upon his family and himself. When inhalation anesthesia was finally introduced in Boston at Massachusetts General Hospital, it was something that Oliver Wendell Holmes would say it would, it's now created a world without pain. So it revolutionized the world. It's going to change the world. Everyone is going to want it.